Hello and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing the Abyssal Sire. Uh, in terms of gear, I'm bringing Osmonton's Fang, Lightbearer Slayer Helm if I didn't have the Spring Demon Bane weaponry, and a Suffering tank gear. Um, if I had them, I'd bring just a shirt, but this is what I got, so cool. Moving on, um, you need anti poison. I'd recommend bringing Super Zep, just magic damage gear. Uh, damage boosting gear, don't need accuracy. Uh, and runes, you want to be on the Ancient Spellbook, Full Shadow Barrage, and Blood Barrage. Uh, let's get started. Start with Shadow Barrage on the boss. Disables these tentacles. And then we can start. Um, I'm just going to Blood Barrage real quick, get my health back up. Because I've done a couple of kills here. And we're full. Okay, so the Shadow Barrage will shut the boss down for 30 seconds. After those 30 seconds are up, we need to recast, so I'm just going to run to the middle. You can't get hit in the middle, this area here, you're safe. It's a good area to stand in if you don't want to get hit by these tentacles, especially when they're active. They're active in two two bits of the fight. The very, very start when you haven't cast Shadow Brush, and um, also in the very last phase when the boss walks over, waddles over, they'll plonk themselves down just there, and uh, tentacles come active again. But if you're in the middle here, these three tiles, you're sound. Never gonna get hit. You'll be fine. Whilst active, the boss can summon little unsired minions. Um, it can also some poison pools underneath your feet. Just be wary of these. That's why I've got the anti-poison. If you don't have anti-poison running, uh, they hit for quite a lot. Not what you want, but um, it happens, so just make sure you've got an anti-poison running. Okay, I think that's all the respiratory systems down, is it? Yes, it is. Excellent. Back with the melee gear, then. Going to put prop melee up. And start slapping. If I get poison under my feet, I'm just going to hop two tiles to the side. Drop in a spec, why not? Alright, that is the animation for a minion getting spawns. These usually die in about one hit, so I think it's always worth trying to kill them. And that is the poison spawn. Not poison resistance running out in a minute, so. Preemptively drink a dose of that. Better safe than sorry. Swapping to prey ranged. These minions predominantly hit with ranged attacks, so that's the minions that are doing damage to us here. Okay, after the teleport, we need to be at least two tiles away within two ticks. Boom. Uh, there was a little explosion just then, and that is the boss decimating, basically. Two tiles away. That's all. It's, it's not overly complicated. Just um, yeah, be two tiles away. I am getting hit by the old melee attack when the health is going down. But um, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. That's why we want the tank gear because they do a combination of attacks. Anyway, um, that's that's the abyssal site. At this point, don't don't eat your foods. That's what I was doing for the majority of my early kills. I was I was eating back to full. Some very short trips, and I completely forgot that you can bring blood barrage rings as well. Um, yeah, do this instead. Make sure you take the time to heal yourself up. I think I've been as low as 30 health and been able to get back to full. So you can definitely do the same. That's um. All I've really got to say uh, on the Abyssal Sire, I wish you good fortune. May you get your bludgeon, happy dagger, whatever it is you're going for. Cheers.